Um, so we're going to play Telephone Pictionary. So Megan, you get to come up with the phrase that needs to make it all the way to the end. Um, so Megan's going to write her phrase on her piece of paper, and then she gets to pick who goes next. So Megan, you get to call out Morgan, and then all of us need to close our eyes, and you're going to hold it up to the screen so Morgan can see it. Um, Morgan, at that time, you'll get 30 seconds to draw what Megan has written, and then you will get to call out the next person, Kate. And then we'll all close our eyes. You'll show Kate the drawing. Kate then has to write in words what she thinks that your drawing is. <laughs> okay. Can we open? Yeah. Yeah. All right, you got 30 seconds, Mo. All right, we are going to go in the order of, of how it happened. Um, actually, sorry, we're gonna go in the backwards order. So Kaylin gets to start. Don't reveal what the original sentence was, okay? Kaylin, you get to go first. Go yours. <laughs> okay. This is mine. <laughs> Jada. <laughs> oh, it was oh, before Jada. Uh, me. Um, I had Bumblebee with hands on hips. <laughs> <laughs> Kate. <laughs> I had Bumblebee with arms crossed. Oh, <laughs> crossed. I thought it'd be person. <laughs> Caroline? Oh, you're on mute. I had a B with a person and then three people with a cross through them in quotes, and I thought it equaled quarantine. I thought it. <laughs> <laughs> Morgan. <laughs> this is what I drew. Oh. <laughs> Use <laughs> <laughs> 